The United States Treasury has issued sanctions against two Kenyan-based businessmen and a long-distance bus company over their links to Al-Shabaab. In a statement dated Monday, March 12, it was revealed that the bus company, which operates its fleet to Mombasa and Buzir, was being used as a money laundering avenue for the terror group. Additionally, it was detailed that the bus company was used by the Somali-based terror group to offer logistic services such as transportation. This includes managing Al-Shabaab funds laundered through investment projects and companies, including through a Kenya-based bus company. The bus company has also supported Al-Shabaab's logistical operations. Further, the U.S. Treasury indicated that the operations of the bus company were being overseen by two businessmen. The U.S. noted that the sanctions were aimed at curtailing the source of revenue for the terror group, who are reported to share some of its proceeds with Al-Qaeda. It was approximated that the Al-Shabaab makes close to 14 billion per year. Part of the money is generated by businesses operating in other countries such as the bus company. Consequently, the U.S. Treasury ordered that businesses linked to the finances of the terror group be surrendered to the Office of Foreign Assets Control. Also sanctioned were businesses that are based in Uganda and Dubai.